वेलकम एवरीबॉडी इन दिस वीडियो विल बी लर्निंग अबाउट मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ डिटर्मिनेंट्स सो लेट अस स्टार्ट विथ मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ डिटर्मिनेंट्स ऑफ सेम मॉड्यूल सो मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑफ डिटर्मिनेंट्स ऑफ सेम ऑर्डर so there is there are many methods the best method is row by column method row by column method so to learn this let us take an example example if del is given a b c b c a c a d now we have to find find del square so what we need to do is we can write del square as del into del now we we'll put the values a b c b c a c a d and here again a b c b c a c a d Now, row by column method works like this. First, we will take a row, then we multiply it by the column. So, let me show you. So, a times a is a square, and again b square plus c square. Now, we will do the same for a and b. It will be a b plus b c plus c a. Now, for this, it will be A C plus A B plus C B. So now again, now this row will go with this. It will be A B plus B C plus C A. This will be B square plus C square plus A square. This will be B C plus C A plus A B. Now again, this row goes with this column. A C plus B A plus B C. This will be B C plus C A plus B A. Now this will be C square plus A square plus B square. This is your product, and this is your answer for del square. You have to remember rows go with columns, and you have to repeat the same process. Now we'll see multiplication of. determinants of different order order so this is exactly same as multiplication with the same order the question may be given like this del 1 is equals to a b c d and del 2 will be given like this p q r s t u v w x so you can write so we can see that both the determinants are of different order so we have to convert del1 into a b0 c d0 and this will be 0 01 now we can easily multiply del1 and del2 by row and column method and we'll get the answer so if you have any problem Please comment below and if you did like my video subscribe to my channel and hit the thumbs up button thank you